Actually, when we both worked together in Tavern in Southern City, um, we would go to a bar on breaks, actually, and they knew they weren't there. Um, and that was the first time any of us had it. Another one of our bartenders likes it there, too. We're sitting around on Sunday drinking. He like, runs back to his apartment, comes back with pickle juice, and we start doing pickle bags. By the end of that night, we're all completely shit-faced, and we decided to stumble down to the deli and buy everything we could find in vinegar and or brine. And we made a lot of mistakes and got sick a couple times. And it actually, it started as a complete joke. I wrote it drunk, we uh, talked to him on the phone the next day, he added the wax back and the dirty Sanchez. Alright, traditional pickle bag. Our whiskey, pickle juice. Your turn, buddy. Put it out literally as a joke. We're just like, people are going to laugh at this. We're never going to sell any of these, but it looks good. And you now we're blowing up through the we go, with this. Yeah, we go through 10 gallons of pickle juice a week. Oh my gosh. Yeah. That's so much. And that's not exaggerated. So, going through the rest of the pickleback menu, the next one on the menu is the pickleback writer, which is actually just this. We just drink the pickle juice first. Uh, the one that we make, I guess, is the most labor intensive by us is the the two utes, which is pepperoni infused spectra vodka and sherry pepper juice. We actually make the pepperoni vodka here. Um, it tastes kind of like a trip to Wawa. It's almost like biting into Italian hoagie by the time you're done with it. A friend of mine forwarded me an article from the French Culinary Institute. Um, they started a whole school where they do molecular like astronomy now. This is from there. It's not actually our own development. Not the pepperoni recipe per se, but the procedure, which is how we came up with the idea. Okay. So that's it. That's pretty Here cool. Goes in, comes out. Pieces of real pepperoni, so you know what's good.